I'm Pastor George Borkard, and this is another Higher Things video short. The law is stopped dead at the cross. That's the subject of today's Higher Things video short. Like, subscribe, ring the bell, get the app, donate. If you love our videos, if you love what we're doing, pass it on the faith to the next generation, like our videos, subscribe to our YouTube channel, ring the bell for notifications, get the Higher Things app, Search for it. It's on Google, iTunes, Amazon. It's even going to be on Roku and Apple TV. And donate. Link in the description. Your tax deductible gift to higherthings.org helps us stay rolling and giving you this gospel every single day. So uh, this Sunday's gospel lesson has this great gem from Jesus. Here it comes. Don't think that I came to Katalusai to abolish the law and the prophets. I did not come to abolish, but to fulfill. Amen, I say to you, um, until heaven and the earth par el pass away, um, uh, not a yoda or a, um, uh, that's a dot, will pass away from the law and here's the gym, until all has happened. You, you hear that, right? So he didn't come to abolish the Old Testament. That's what Law and the Prophets is. Don't hear Law and the Prophets and think, oh, so this is only about the Law. No, this is about the Law and the Prophets, the whole of the Old Testament. Law, Prophets, Psalms. That's what your Old Testament is composed of. He didn't come to abolish that. He came to fulfill that. Uh, and so uh, his fulfilling of the law and the prophets is what he does with his holy life and his bitter sufferings and death. And until heaven and earth pass away, not an iota, uh, not a yoda, not a dot from the law will pass away until all is accomplished. Well, let me tell you where all is accomplished. A lot of times folks think that all is accomplished means the last day. And I would have no problems with that. But yet there is a last day before the last day, and that's Calvary. On the cross, the law and the prophets are fulfilled. On the cross, um, uh, the last day happens. On the cross, um, all is accomplished. All is fulfilled. All happens. Christ's death on the cross is, is the event in the history of mankind. It's, it's the event on which the law comes to a screeching halt. Um, it's condemnation. The law still remains, but it's condemnation dies with Jesus on the cross. Think about that. The law's condemnation of you, the law's condemning word of you, the constant chatter of the law telling you that you don't live as you should live and you don't do what you should do and you, sh and you do what you shouldn't do. All of that dies with Jesus on the cross. All of it. When he dies, the law's fulfilled. When he dies, the law's condemnation dies with him. Everything that God could be mad at you for dies with Jesus on the cross. He raises from the dead. You are raised to a new life now spent telling of him, singing of him in all that you do and say. Now you pick up the law to love your neighbor, not to fulfill the law yourself. That's already been done, but to learn how to love others to learn how to kill your old Adam with all its sinful desires that a new man can rise to live and to love those around you. Because love is the fulfillment of the law. And so the law comes to, the law dies with Jesus so that you might live finally for others. Free. To have the law condemn you, you leave Jesus. You leave Jesus and all of the law and all of the condemnation and all of the wrath of God comes back to you. That's what hell is. Hell is the wrath of God for sinners 
but you will never see that wrath in Jesus because he has taken that wrath upon himself and died. And by his death, you have been set free to finally love and serve your neighbor. Think about it. I did not come to abolish the law and the prophets. I didn't come to abolish the Old Testament. I came to fulfill it for you. I'm Pastor George Barkart and a sleeping Thor. And this has been another Higher Things video short.